Hey everyone, it's little Lollycat here and I have more updates. So, this one has been once again quite a while coming. As some of you are aware, we were discontinuing the Boompa. And there has been a slight change. So after saying we were going to discontinue it, basically a bunch of people came out and said, please don't, we love this. And other people went, yay, we hate it because it's Marmite to people. Literally Marmite. People either seem to really like it or they really don't like it. And so what we've done instead is we've decided to lean into it and basically go, you know what? It is loud. It is in your face. Let's make it more loud and in your face. <laughs> So, let's show you the new and improved Super Boomba, which is now 6,000 milliliters. It is a wider, slightly wider cut than before. It's not as wide as some, but wider than we normally use, so it doesn't get uncomfortable. And as you can see, it is just as loud and brash as ever. <laughs> so, we have literally just gotten these in, so I'm going to open this up to show you. Ah, I'm bad at opening these packs. So here we go. So we are now using a different kind of sap. So first off, you will note that it is wider. These are wider than usual. But what you might find is it's surprisingly thin. But the reason for this is because the sap we have used is extremely expensive. It basically, it comes in thin and then it's one of the ones that instead of using fluffing, basically cardboard dust basically expands and this is the whole point of it so we have the quite soft feel plastic as you can see it's still loud and proud with all the um, colors um we do have a bit of noise everyone likes a pretty <laughs> landing strip right it's still two tabs however i will say obviously we switched tabs when we went to plain and simple to be a substantially stronger tab that if you have tried them you will be more than aware that if you get them stuck to your skin pray because you need help <laughs> they, they do not want to let go it's great <laughs> it's very ha it is genuinely handy if you wear them so these are available now as you can see obviously we still have the waistbands so that you get that added fit um so for people who liked boompa this will probably be a bonus that you now have one that is six thousand that has better sap than ever before because yes we could have used um cheap sap and basically made a pack of 10 like this big instead but realistically use wise that would be abysmal <laughs> so there we go and next up so originally when we were discussing getting well we weren't discussing getting rid of bimpa we were discussing altering bimpa we discussed the concept of superheroes and this is how this has came about. So I am producing, <laughs> introducing you to the bed tents, who are bedtime sleep time protectors. So these are a pack of 10. I haven't yet to open them, obviously. They are on the same shell as these ones. So they are once again wider, but they have multiple options for panels inside. So I should open them up. So we have a superhero bear, we have a detective penguin, we have a heffalump, and we have genuinely quite babyish looking print. We have mostly all over print in white. We have double tabs once again, slightly wider, and this is one print. We have Superhero Bear actually flying, as can be seen. And we have Detective Flips Flipperton over here with his magnifying glass. So you get three designs in a pack. They are all quite babyish. I have just put these together so well. <laughs> They are all quite babyish, as you can see. They once again, they have the waistbands. They have obviously high standing leg guards, which you kind of need. They have obviously this section in the middle for the blue, where it's a little bit more absorbent for use. But 
yeah, we came out with something that's a little bit more babyish in the actual waistbands than what we've been doing, a little bit less loud than what we've been doing, and hopefully you all appreciate that, really. Yeah! <laughs> How long's it been? Since we started this project? How long's it been? Yes. I don't even remember. Exactly. <laughs> it's been so long. This is probably pre-Covid. It would be pre-Covid. That's how long it takes to get dips into production, by the way, for anyone that wonders. Literally, it takes a long time. The process takes a long time. There's always issues. Always issues. And obviously a long time waiting for things to actually arrive to and everything else yeah so basically we have our teddy 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 our with not just teddy bears for once we actually have teddy bears you can even see on the scripts we have flying teddy bears we have flips flipperton doing his little thing with his magnifying glass and we have um, Heffel right here and the big <laughs> secret is the reason they have names already <laughs> is because all these pictures are actually based off of my bed tits. So Heffel is currently sitting next to me so this is Heffel who is currently hiding. Flipperton, Mr Flips Flipperton is over here and the teddy bear is actually based off of a teddy bear I had when I was basically first born and he was my first ever bear and that's why he's there as a little superhero and because I thought it would be adorable to draw him trying to fly with some balloons. <laughs> so these are literally the Bed Ted gang and I really really hope you all like him. There ha- I will not lie there has been a slight accidental leaking as there always is when when we first introduce these characters well introduce a new dip someone apparently someone may have stolen from a factory and sent a pack to someone so i would like to basically say thank you to the person who then when i contacted them removed the pictures and was very very nice about it so and the people who retweeted as well i mean yeah everyone was really nice about removing them because we we've basically been working on this for a while and basically having your <laughs> your release released before you release is quite hard to manage usually that was september mm -hmm. so thank you to them so much for basically keeping this under wraps when they found out what was going on I completely understand like it was not their fault in the slightest I will say they were very very nice about it and yay upward and upward bye everyone <laughs>